Hey guys, John from Lorenz. Uh, welcome to the beautiful Albert Falls Dam here in Kuzulu Natal. Uh, today we're talking a little bit about the HDS Pro range. Um, I just want to show you guys quickly on how to do custom pages and, and how you can manipulate them and change them and, and put them the way you want them. So first off we're going to hit the pages button. You're going to see on the right hand side there's a, if you scroll up you'll see there's a little plus button. I'm going to click on the plus. Now I'm going to pull in chart with sonar. You know, I would like a bit of side scan, but I don't like the layout that it's currently on. So at the top right hand corner, I can pull that in like that. So I've still got structure and chart at the bottom. I'll swap the structure with the chart because I want the longer screen at the bottom. And I like the chart on the left hand side and not on the right hand side. And then I'll hit save. So now you'll see I have just created that page. I've got my chart, I've got my 3D sonar and then obviously my 3-in-1 HD transducer running down the middle and now this is always saved on the right hand side of the screen you can go in on the preset screens and you can edit them and customize them to whatever you want all you need to remember is when you customize a screen there are no overlays on the screen because it's custom so once you've selected it you press your power button you go down to your edit overlay and then you can go to add and then choose all your overlays that you want like your time, speed over ground, course, destination, trip, uh, distance to destination, cross track error, uh, all those kind of things, water temperature, all can be displayed then on that screen and then every screen that you create after that you'll have to go back and then customize that screen to what your needs are. Guys remember to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time we upload a new video.